The intricacies of space have long fascinated scientists and science fiction enthusiasts alike. The discoveries that stand to be undiscovered deep within the unseen expanse stretching beyond our atmosphere are almost limitless. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we'll be looking at three recent discoveries and how they helped to further our understanding of science and the final frontier. Physicists broke the speed of light. The speed of light has long been touted as the fastest possible speed that any molecule or wavelength can travel. And at about 300,000 kilometers per second, this appeared to be a pretty safe bet. However, in the interest of constantly pushing the limits of what we think we know, researchers recently demonstrated that photons, which are elementary particles that have zero mass but carry an electromagnetic charge, can be manipulated in ways that could allow particles to break this as yet unbroken barrier for speed. In several recent experiments, researchers have recorded that waves composed of groups of photons were able to move at speeds faster than the speed of light. In fact, in groundbreaking new experiments, researchers from Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory in California and the University of Rochester in New York were able to get these photon waves to speeds that were an astonishing 30% faster than the speed of light. While previous experiments were able to manipulate photon waves by moving them through cold atomic gases, refractive crystals and optical flares, these new record-breaking trials used hot plasma full of charged particles to conduct the light waves at such incredible speeds. Although it seems futuristic for speeds to have been recorded faster than the speed of light, in truth, the researchers actually ingeniously manipulated already well-understood principles of physics in order to create these results. Photons move by pulsing with electromagnetic fields acting upon the waves, which have what is known as group velocity. The researchers changed the group velocity of light pulses within the plasma by stripping electrons to manipulate the refractory effects. Although the speed of light waves remained constant, the overall effect was of increased speed and acceleration. These discoveries help researchers to understand even more about the laws of physics surrounding plasma and how it can be used to further develop current models. But why bother manipulating these particles if they lack mass and therefore could never allow us to reach the stars, no matter how fast they are able to go? Although we cannot rely on them to show us the way towards faster space travel, the principles uncovered during these experiments could help to uncover new types of lasers and other technology. Currently, certain aspects of these promising technologies are being held back by technical difficulties created by barriers of physics. Researchers are hopeful that the new knowledge surrounding increasing speeds of photons in hot plasma will allow for the creation of newer, much more powerful lasers that model the electromagnetic characteristics of these experimental photon waves. While you might not think that lasers are altogether an important aspect of science, they are an integral piece of technology that could usher in advancements such as more powerful particle accelerators and more effective clean fusion technology. Breaking the speed of light, even if it does not necessarily spell the future for spacecraft being able to reach faraway stars, still holds great promise for being able to usher in a new era of technological advancements. James Webb Space Telescope takes first photo of an alien world When it comes to study of worlds besides our own, we have already discovered hundreds upon thousands of exoplanets with interesting characteristics, orbiting their own versions of our Sun. Although any one of them might be operating under the just right conditions to sustain life, it has been hard for researchers to come to any certain conclusions about these faraway worlds because we lacked the technology to view them in greater detail. It appears that the James Webb Space Telescope is going to change all of this, as it recently captured its first direct images of an exoplanet, HIP 65426b. Through these images, scientists were able to determine that this planet has a mass of about seven times more than Jupiter. It's also incredibly hot, 
with cloud tops measuring at temperatures of about 1400 degrees Celsius. Although the existence of HIP 65426b was already known to researchers, it had been discovered in an indirect way that most alien planets are discovered. Typically, researchers are able to identify exoplanets by watching the actions of their host stars and other bodies in order to infer the presence of a planet. Many of them orbit so close to their stars that it makes direct imaging nearly impossible. This was one such planet which researchers knew about but had never seen directly. The JWST changed that, using several coronagraphs which allow it to photograph planets while blocking out the overwhelmingly bright light from nearby stars. Although the finer details of the planet remain hidden, the photograph simply shows a bright dot glowing a short distance away from its sun. The fact that the telescope was able to capture such an image is a huge advancement for researchers. In fact, although the James Webb Space Telescope was already widely touted as an incredible technological advancement for space research, it has been delivering at levels that are approximately 10 times better than projected. This greatly widens the realm of potential discoveries that might be made with the spectacular capabilities of this telescope. The discovery of the existence of exoplanets was in fact a fairly recent occurrence, and although we certainly know that there are more Earth-like worlds than we could have ever imagined, the more minute details have continued to evade researchers due to the indirect nature of most of their discoveries. These incredible photographs from the JWST have indicated that soon we will be able to have direct observations of many more exoplanets, and the far unparalleled performance of the photographs means that we will likely be able to observe alien planets with sizes much, much smaller than expected. NASA fixed Voyager 1 even though it's in interstellar space When it comes to space, Voyager 1 has become somewhat of a fixture. Launched in September of 1977 and exploring the depths of space for 45 years, the space probe has been the catalyst for dozens of vital discoveries that have proven foundational to our understanding of space and the cosmos at large. Originally only expected to have a lifespan of about four years, currently Voyager 1 is the farthest human-made object in space at over 10 billion miles away from Earth. Earlier this year, it seemed that Voyager 1 may have finally begun a slow decline into dysfunction, as it started to send back garbled, unreadable data. Unsurprisingly, it's rather difficult to repair space probes when they are deep within interstellar space billions of miles away, so the research team working with the probe began to fear that the end was near for Voyager 1. But researchers on the Voyager team were able to figure out a way to resolve the glitch, which was no small feat when dealing with technology that was created almost half a century ago. It turned out that the probe itself was still functioning well and sending out strong signals, but a computer on board had gone faulty several years prior and was responsible for jumbling the information as it left the probe to be beamed to Earth. This made it a rather easy fix, as the research team simply instructed the control system to reroute the information through a second working computer on board instead. The fact that the issue was purely technological was lucky for the Voyager team, as a mechanical failing would likely be fatal to the mission. Suzanne Dodd, project manager for Voyager, issued a press release concerning the issue, stating that we're happy to have the telemetry back. We'll do a full memory readout of the AACS and look at everything it's been doing. That will help us try to diagnose the problem that caused the telemetry issue in the first place, so we're cautiously optimistic but we still have more investigating to do. Voyager 1 and its twin, Voyager 2, are iconic pieces of space history that have quite literally blazed new trails through interstellar space in the decades that they have been active. The information that they have provided to scientists back on Earth has proven invaluable to our knowledge of what lies beyond the Earth's atmosphere. Researchers expect that, although they were able to sort out the current Voyager 1 glitch, the pair of vintage space probes will begin to go offline by 2025, only a few years away. But for a lifespan of over four decades past the original projections, Voyagers 1 and 2 have certainly lived long lives and well fulfilled their duty to scientific exploration and discovery.
But what do you make of these recent discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.